Hi kindergartners, this is Miss Moses. I'm here for our Monday math lesson. And today we're going to keep learning about patterns. And we know some patterns can be like circle, circle, square, circle, circle, square, or they could be red, yellow, red, yellow, red, yellow. So today we're going to create our own patterns. So I'm going to show you how you can create a pattern with some things you might have in your house for a lot of fun to use some objects. And then I'm going to also show you how to create a pattern using crayons or markers to do some color patterns. But we're going to start by doing some patterns using objects. Okay, kindergartners. So I'm going to make my first pattern. I'm going to use one using pom-poms that I have in my house. So I have some yellow and purple pom-poms. I'm going to do a pattern that's going to go purple, yellow, purple, yellow. Watch me. Purple, yellow, purple, yellow, purple, yellow. I made my own pattern. Purple, yellow, purple, yellow, purple, yellow. I'm gonna use those same pom-poms to make a different kind of pattern. This time I'm going to do two purples, one yellow. Two purples, one yellow. Purple, purple, yellow. Purple, purple, yellow. I made a pattern, purple, purple, yellow, purple, purple, yellow. So it's two purples, one yellow, and then it repeats. Patterns have to repeat. I found some different objects that I'm going to use to make a pattern. I have some raisins and some chocolate chips. I'm going to do chocolate chip, chocolate chip, raisin, chocolate chip, chocolate chip, Raisin. What a fun pattern. Chocolate chip, chocolate chip, raisin. Chocolate chip, chocolate chip, raisin. I'll do another pattern. Raisin, chocolate chip. Raisin, chocolate chip. Raisin, chocolate chip. Oh, it's so fun doing patterns. Let's see what else I can find. I found some yellow and white golf balls. I'm going to do my pattern going yellow golf ball, white golf ball, yellow golf ball, white golf ball. They really roll around. Yellow, white, yellow, white, yellow, white. So fun. I also found some pennies and some quarters. I'm gonna make a pattern using pennies and quarters. Penny, quarter, quarter. Penny, quarter, quarter. So fun. Penny, quarter, quarter, penny, quarter, quarter. I'm gonna come up with my own pattern, a different one. This time I'll switch. Penny, quarter, Penny, quarter, penny, quarter. I love making patterns. So kindergartners, I just showed you how to make patterns using objects in your house, but you could also make patterns using crayons or markers. So if I'm going to use crayons, I'm gonna pick two different colored crayons. I'm going to do red and blue. And then I need to decide what I want my pattern to be and then when it's going to repeat. So I think I'm gonna start with a blue and I'm gonna do a circle, blue circle, and then I'm gonna do a red circle. So if I'm doing my pattern, now it needs to repeat. Blue, red, then I'll do a blue. And then if I'm doing my own pattern, I'm switching between the two colors. So I did blue, red, blue, then I do a red, then I do a blue, then I do a red. 
So I switched the colors. I can use the same two crayons to make a different kind of pattern. This time I'm going to make a pattern doing two circles of one color and then one circle of another color. So I'm gonna start with red this time and I'll go red, red, and then I'll use the blue. So red, red, blue. Now it's going to repeat red, red, blue. So fun to use the crayons to make patterns. I'm gonna show you another example using the crayons to make a pattern. This time I'm going to use a green and a purple. This time I think I'm gonna do a purple and then two greens, green, green. Then I'll do repeat. Purple, green, green. Purple, purple, green, green, purple, green, green, purple. I made a pattern. This time I think I wanna add in one more crayon. I'm gonna do a challenge. <gasps> Whoa, I'm gonna do purple, green, red, and then I'm going to repeat. Purple, green, red. Then I'll repeat, do a purple again. Purple, green, red. Then purple. Okay, kindergartners, I had so much fun making patterns using some objects in my house and then also making patterns using my crayons and drawing circles. It's really fun to switch between the different colors to make a pattern. But I also really enjoyed using objects in my house. And I was thinking, I know so many of you have Legos in your house. It would be really fun to make a pattern using Legos. Like you could do blue Lego, yellow Lego, blue Lego, yellow Lego. I thought Legos would be really fun. Or maybe you have another toy in your house that you have different colors of that you could make a pattern using. And I would love to see your pattern. So if you do a pattern with objects, you could take a picture of that and send it to me on Class Dojo. Or you could do it with crayons and you could draw your own squares to fill in, making your own pattern. Or you could print off Class Dojo. I'll put a little template so that you can print that if you want to draw or build your patterns using objects. So great job, kindergartners. I love creating patterns with you. Okay, bye for now.